I don't have much time, but I have an urgent prophetic word for some people that are watching even now. It is imperative that you lend me your ears right now. There are people right now that God is about to deliver from an old season into a new season. There's about to be a migration because the season that you're in, you can no longer occupy. And God in this season is about to strategically connect you to your destiny helpers. There will be a divine connection that God himself is going to establish in your life to assist you to get from one point to the next point. There are people in this season that God himself is about to shower his favor upon as he did with Jesus the Messiah. The Bible says in the book of Acts chapter 10 verses 38 that God gave Jesus Christ favor with both God and man and in this season there are people entering into a very strategic season a season of birth and no longer shall you wander my God and ask yourself has God really called me am I really chosen how long will I remain in this season how long will I be frustrated hallelujah by the elements of delay but in this season God is about to cause you to connect to your destiny connection your destiny helper there is someone strategic that is going to hold your hand. Hallelujah. There is someone that is going to see what you carry. There is someone that is going to assist you, my God, to get this plane off the ground. This will be a very defining season for you that is watching, where the Lord is saying that your plane is about to take off in the name of Jesus. Your ministry is about to take off in the name of Jesus. Your business is about to take off in the name of Jesus. Everything that has been parked, detained, derailed, in this season. My God is about to encounter the power of God, the acceleration of God, the advancement of God, as it was for Ruth when she encountered her destiny connection, Naomi. And Naomi would bring her out of one territory into another territory in Bethlehem where she would encounter Boaz. God in this season is about to align you with your destiny connection, as it was with Hadassah and even her relative Mordecai. Mordecai, how there would be a connection there. Glory be to God. Not only Mordecai, but even the eunuch that was serving the king. People of God, there is something that God is about to orchestrate in your life as it pertains to a destiny connection in this season. Glory be to God. My God, your days of being dejected. My God, the days of feeling despondent. Hallelujah. The days, my God, of having penina ridicule you. My God, those days have come to a culmination. And there are people in this season that God is about to advance his agenda. Kingdom come. Let your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. I am seeing strategic, defining, prophetic, divine connections. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. I don't know how God is going to execute what he has spoken, but God is about to do this thing. Hallelujah. That there are people literally that are going to move from one city to another city, from one nation to another nation. Glory be to God. And suddenly things are going to begin happening. As it was with Elisha and Elijah, glory be to God. When the Lord sent Elijah to go place his mantle, his cloak over Elisha, glory. Elisha did not even know that his time had come. My God, that his season where he was just mowing the grass had come to an end. Hallelujah. And that now God was about to align him with his master Elijah. And at the appointed time, he was going to make a request, a prophetic request, that the thing that is on you... I I want a double portion of the anointing that is resting upon your life. This is very powerful. And then Elijah said, if you see me taken, you will receive, my God, your request. There are people in this season that God is about to align a divine connection in your life. Joshua, my God, was aligned with Moses, not knowing he would be a successor of Moses. Hallelujah. There is someone that God is about to align you with in this season. Ah, Rabba Sata Rebe Kuraba Rata Karebo Bobo Sunda Labaya Reku Zebedi Sataya Rakata Baria Sotora Manda Riba Babaro Sepelekaya. I want you to lift up your hand. My God, if this word is for you, you're going to feel fire moving through your body right now. In the name of Jesus Christ, 
My God, the Lord who has called me shall bring this word to pass in your life, in my life, in the name of Jesus. You're going to feel this fire moving through your body. I want you to share this message now with everyone that you know. Glory be to God. For there are people in whom God is about to align with a divine connection in this season in the name of Jesus. My God, share what you're feeling right now. His presence is here. His glory is here. Hallelujah. There is something God is birthing in this season. He said, behold, I am doing a new thing. Shall you not perceive it? My God, behold, I am doing a new thing. Shall you not perceive it? This is a pastor-wise preach. And I give God all the glory. I invite everyone that is watching to partner with this ministry with your finances. My God, sow your seed. You can visit the website wisepreach.com and sow there. You can go to cash app dollar sign wise preach. But I want you to connect your seed to this word and the Lord will bless you in the name of Jesus.